Have you ever wondered which is more challenging? Exploring space or the deep sea? Both space and the deep sea are incredibly challenging environments to explore. Space is vast and empty with extreme temperatures and radiation. The deep sea is dark, cold and high pressure. Yet, both environments offer the potential for incredible discoveries. In space, we could find new planets to live on or even life beyond Earth. In the deep sea, we could discover new species of animals or even new forms of life. The exploration of space and the deep sea is a race against time. As our planet changes, these environments are becoming increasingly threatened. We need to explore them now, while we still can. Once upon a time, humans were fascinated by the vast and unexplored depths of the ocean. The mysteries that lay beneath the waves captivated the public imagination and ocean exploration was seen as the final frontier. But as the 20th century dawned, a new frontier emerged. The space race between the United States and Russia captured the world's attention and sparked a new era of exploration. The challenge of designing vessels that could withstand and navigate through a vacuum was daunting, but the rewards were great. The public was captivated by the idea of exploring the unknown reaches of the universe, and funding poured in. Meanwhile, ocean exploration struggled to keep up. Despite the fact that the oceans cover more than 70% of the Earth's surface, they remained largely unexplored and uncharted. The challenges of deep sea exploration were no less daunting than those of space. But the public's interest had shifted. Space exploration was seen as the ultimate adventure, while ocean exploration was seen as old news. As a result, space exploration has received far more funding than deep sea exploration. NASA's budget is in the billions, while the entire yearly budget for the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, ENOAA, is only $20 million. This discrepancy has led some to argue that we should be focusing more on exploring the oceans, which are a little studied but very promising area for much enhanced exploration. Despite this, public interest has continued to prioritize space exploration over oceanic exploration. The allure of the unknown reaches of the universe is simply too great to resist. While there are certainly benefits to exploring space, such as the potential for discovering new sources of energy and resources, it's important to remember that the oceans are also a vital part of our planet. They are home to countless species of plants and animals, and they play a crucial role in regulating the Earth's climate. The ocean is a vast and mysterious place, covering over 70% of the Earth's surface. Despite its importance to our planet, the ocean remains largely unexplored, with less than 5% of it having been seen let alone explored. One of the biggest challenges of exploring the ocean is the high pressure that exists at great depths. The pressure at the bottom of the ocean can be over 1,000 times greater than at the surface, making it difficult for humans and equipment to withstand. Additionally, the low visibility of the ocean makes it difficult to see what lies beneath the surface. This can make it challenging to navigate and explore, as well as to locate specific features or organisms Exploring the ocean is also a difficult and expensive endeavor. The cost of glass was once a major obstacle to ocean exploration, as it was needed for the construction of underwater viewing devices. Today, the cost of advanced technology, research vessels and personnel can make ocean exploration prohibitively expensive. Despite the challenges, ocean exploration is critical to understanding our planet and the life that exists within it. The ocean is home to a vast array of species, many of which have yet to be discovered. It also plays a critical role in regulating the Earth's climate and weather patterns. Despite the potential for discovery, the vast majority of the seafloor is barren and featureless mud. However, there are still many fascinating features to be found in the ocean, including the largest mountain range on Earth, canyons far grander than the Grand Canyon, and towering vertical cliffs rising up three miles. Mapping the ocean floor is an ongoing process, with new discoveries being made all the time. 
the ocean remains a largely unexplored frontier, full of mystery and wonder, as we continue to explore and learn more about the ocean. We gain a greater understanding of our planet and our place within it. Space and deep sea exploration are two fields that share many similarities, but also have unique challenges and contributions to our understanding of the world and ourselves. Both fields require advanced technology and equipment to explore and survive in extreme environments. The deep sea is characterized by high pressure, low temperatures, and complete darkness, while space is characterized by extreme temperatures, radiation, and lack of air and gravity. Communication and navigation are difficult in both fields due to the vast distances and lack of landmarks. The cost of exploration is high in both fields, requiring significant funding and resources. Deep sea exploration has led to the discovery of new species and ecosystems, as well as the study of geological and oceanographic processes. It has also provided insights into the origins of life on Earth and the potential for life on other planets. Space exploration has led to the discovery of new planets, stars, and galaxies, as well as the study of the origins and evolution of the universe. It has also provided insights into the effects of microgravity on human health and the potential for human colonization of other planets. Deep sea exploration has contributed to the development of technologies for underwater vehicles, sensors, and communication systems, which have applications in oceanography, marine biology, and environmental monitoring. Space exploration has contributed to the development of technologies for spacecraft, satellites, and telescopes, which have applications in communication, navigation, and remote sensing. Science has been the driving force behind many of the world's greatest discoveries and inventions. From electricity to penicillin, vaccines to the molecular structure of DNA, and our ability for teamwork, these discoveries have changed the world in countless ways. Electricity is one of the most significant discoveries of all time. It has revolutionized the way we live, work, and communicate. It powers our homes, our businesses, and our cities. It has allowed us to create new technologies and explore new frontiers. Without electricity, our modern world would be a very different place. Penicillin is another discovery that has changed the world. It was the first antibiotic discovered by Alexander Fleming in 1928. It has saved countless lives and revolutionized the way we treat infections. Before penicillin, even minor infections could be deadly. Today, we take antibiotics for granted, but they are one of the most important medical discoveries of all time. The molecular structure of DNA is another significant discovery. It has allowed us to understand the building blocks of life and has revolutionized the field of genetics. It has led to new treatments for genetic diseases and has allowed us to explore the origins of life itself. Finally, our ability for teamwork is a discovery that has allowed us to achieve great things. It has allowed us to build great civilizations, explore new frontiers, and create new technologies. It has allowed us to work together to solve some of the world's most pressing problems and has allowed us to achieve things that would have been impossible for any one person to accomplish alone. In conclusion, both space and deep sea exploration present immense challenges and offer great potential for discovery. While space exploration has received more public attention and funding, deep sea exploration is equally important for understanding our planet and the life within it. Both fields require advanced technology, face extreme environments, and contribute to scientific and technological advancements. The discoveries and inventions made through scientific exploration, such as electricity, penicillin, DNA structure, vaccines, and our ability for teamwork have shaped the world we live in today and continue to push the boundaries of human knowledge and understanding. In the spirit of exploration and discovery, we would love to hear your thoughts on the topic. Which do you find more challenging, exploring space or the deep sea? What are your reasons for your choice? Do you think we should allocate more resources to deep sea exploration? Or perhaps you have other ideas about the importance of both fields of exploration? Share your insights, opinions, and questions in the comments below. Let's engage in a stimulating discussion and learn from each other's perspectives. 
Together, we can deepen our understanding of these fascinating frontiers and the impact they have on our world.